everybody, and welcome back to G-Bears Off-Grid Ways. Yeah, overcast again today. All the tees, no rain out of it. Well, looks like they might be getting some right up over there by the mountains, on the other side of the mountains. And I know they got some over there earlier today because I checked radar, and they were getting some pretty good... Uh, thunderstorms over there. They had some of those big monsoonal thunderheads growing up over there. Looks like they're getting a little bit of a sprinkle right over there. And uh, you can feel a little bit of the um, humidity in the air, but uh, I don't think it's going to rain. It's, I wish it would rain. I gotta be careful what I sing. I might get a copyright on it. <laughs> anyway, what do you think about the new intro? I uh, put that together today because it was uh, well over 100 degrees today and just miserable. So I said, well, I'm going to sit down and work on my editing software and see what I can put together. Now, I'm going to have to get my binoculars out here in a little while and see what that is right out there in the desert. Let's see if I can zoom in. Uh, can you see? Let me get my finger in there. See right above my finger there's something tan colored or white colored or something in the desert over there. So I'll have to go do some investigation and see what that is as we zoom back out. So, yeah, it looks like there's one little spot of rain coming down right over there. Interesting. And there's a little bit right behind those mountains over there. I feel a little coolness in the air like it should rain. But, of course, I get blue skies over me, right? That's just the norm. <laughs> Sorry about that, Norm. Whoever you are. <laughs> oh, so. Anyway, I was talking about my new intro. And uh, I put that together. I'm still going to work on it a little bit more. I threw together some uh, collage of pictures at the beginning. And uh, uh, put those all into um, a little presentation. And I'm going to try adding one to the end of this uh, video instead of posting the um, subscribes and that stuff all through the video. Uh, I'll still put those in every now and then, but uh, I'm going to try this uh, new end screen I'm, I want to use. And uh, let me know what you guys think about uh, what I'm doing here because I'm not going to get another... Um, Let's see, how, how can I put this? I, I'm not going to get another threat that I had a violation and my uh, video can't be monetized. Um, but I didn't have a copyright infringement. So I didn't have a copyright infringement. But somebody who, you, uh, who claims that that song that I used at the beginning is theirs... Um, says that uh, they don't want me using it, but it came with the um, editing software that I got, and it's in the album marked uh, free to use. As long as you're using that editing software, you're supposed to be able to be able to use that stuff free of charge. Wow, I'm going to have to get out here and do some cleaning. You guys are making a mess of the place, you know that? So, I'm hoping it'll be a little cooler tomorrow. I do have another package coming in the mail with another product that I'm really excited about getting. And it's supposed to come on Monday, but there's supposed to be two items. And the tracking I've been checking is only showing one item. Now, I don't know if they um, put them together in one package or what, but... Uh, I need both of those before I can do my video that I want to do with those. Uh, 
uh, that'll be a, a pretty interesting um, video when that comes out. I'm sure you'll enjoy it all. And uh, I have some real special offers uh, for my viewers uh, who uh, like what I'm going to review. So you'll be able to get yourself some savings. Well, from the back of me, I can feel like there's that rain moisture uh, hitting me in the back with the light breeze. But it uh, doesn't look like there's any rain on its way to me. So that's about it. I see all the wild birds around here. Usually when you see a lot of birds like that, it means that rain's on its way. But uh, out here, all those birds are around because there's food here. Or there's food and water. And they get into the chicken coop. They eat all the chicken feed. They drink all the chicken water. And then when they're out of that over there, my rooster crows out and lets me know that he needs food and water. And then uh, all those birds come over and they drink all the dog water. So that's about it. I got one of the uh, little doctor puppies here. Cinnamon here was just uh, uh, licking my um, dog bite in the back of my leg. I got from breaking up a dog fight. And I uh, uh, thought I saw something over there in the desert too, but that's the, the trash that somebody dumped over there when they dumped poor little uh, Cloudy Day, the female pit bull. Uh, that's where I found her. Well, I found her over there, but she wouldn't follow me home. Uh, two of the male dogs went over there and got her that night and brought her home. So she's been here ever since, and she's getting along pretty much with the pack. So that's because I, I think Doggy Daddy uh, pretty much uh, is the one that accepted her, and he's the leader of the pack, so all the others have to accept her too. Although... Susie Q gets a little upset. But Blackie hangs around and takes care of Susie Q. That's her son. And he's bigger than Doggy Daddy. But uh, she knows where to get her protection from, right? All right. So that's about it. I'm going to close this one off. Go edit in that final picture. Don't forget to wait till the end and see that picture at the end. And uh, we'll go from there. You know, have a few modifications uh, coming along in the future, but uh, this is what I've come up with so far. Thanks for joining me. This is G-Bear signing off.